Hey everybody, it's Kit Kat. Um, I'm going to be opening my Globin box this month. Um, for those of you who don't know, I have been getting Globin, but I ended up canceling due to the cost of it. Um, right now in my life, I don't really need the stuff that they provide. And um, the price is a little high right now to be getting stuff that I don't necessarily um, need or I'm planning to really use too much. So. I went ahead and canceled it. However, Globin is an amazing box, an amazing subscription service. So um, if you do like the box, I highly recommend it if you have the funds and it does have stuff that you like, you should definitely check them out. They will be linked below. For those of you who don't know about Globin, um, it is a subscription box. They do provide very unique products. I want to say unique products because they source handmade products and some of these products like are literally just made for their box. So they source handmade products that are ethically sourced so fair trade and the people that make it get fair wages for what they are making. So very very great company. Um, they do have amazing customer service. You'll see it if you join their community. You'll see like every time there's a problem they fix it right away. For me, my story is that um, I didn't realize they were going to charge me the day before that I thought my subscription renew was going to renew and I was just about to cancel it when I saw that a payment was pending to come out of my pen pal. So I emailed them at the time because when that payment was going to come out was when a lot of stuff was happening financially, I just didn't have the money. Um, I emailed them checking to see if possibly I could have it cancelled because I didn't realize it was going to come out and um, you know, explaining my situation basically and they did take a bit. Um, I know they have a lot of emails and because of the pandemic they're probably a little bit more shorthanded than normal. So it did take them a while to get to my email, but when they did, they did say that they would make the exception to cancel even though I knew that normally they don't do that normally. If it renews, it renews, that's it. Um, and I did let them know in my email that I would have been okay with it renewing because it's my fault. I should have canceled it earlier. I shouldn't have waited till last minute. But they went ahead and canceled it for me. And it did take a while for the funds to get back, but when it did back, it was perfect timing because I had bills to pay. And I'm very, very grateful to them. And I will come back to Globin when I have the opportunity. So just wanted to share that with you guys. But yeah, let's go ahead and get into opening. Um, real fast. I do realize that one eyelash is flapped up more than the other eyelash, but I'm just happy I got them on my eyeballs safely without poking anything and they're stuck on like good. They're not coming off thankfully. Um, if you watch my other videos, you know I don't wear lashes too often, so it's amazing when I like get them on like good. I'm gonna say these are good. I don't care if one is flapped a little bit more off than the other one. Um, if you have problems with your lashes, let me know. Uh, if you wear falsies like I do sometimes. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and open it. So that's the box. Um, it looks the same every time, so you definitely know it's the Globin box when you get it. And of course, the inside is this beautiful, beautiful design with this beautiful color that I love so much. Like, for real, I love it. All right, and I got the cozy box this time, um, which I was inspired to get from Nicole. So Nicole has a channel, which I will link down below. Um, you should definitely check her out. Um, she does unboxings like I do. She does have different boxes than I do also, so you'll be able to see newer stuff. And she usually has her goats in the video, which I think is awesome. They're so funny sometimes and playful and they like eat the stuff sometimes. It's so, so cute and funny and I love it. I love animals. So of course, like I love her channel. I love seeing what she's gonna get in her boxes and see her goats. Um, but yeah, so I got the cozy box. So there it is. And this is our guide to the items that I got in my box. Um, which you can see on the front, they always show you what you're gonna get. And I'm super excited because when Nicole opened her cozy box, I was like, this looks really good. Okay, let me get through all of the packaging. So the first item that I see, I'm gonna take out, 
I think there's stuff inside of it. That's this. It's a um, Galito palm leaf basket uh, in purple. So measurements are six inches by five inches made out of palm leaf. It says it is water resistant um, and it was made in Mexico. Globe and, and this is a Globin company, I guess. That is so awesome. Okay, so this has a little tag on it which has a picture. I'm assuming of the people that make it for Globin, and that is so awesome. So it has more information over there, and then of course the Globin website. But um, I believe there's other stuff in here. Okay, and I just want to say, um, this doesn't normally have the prices in it, just because normally, um, because it's made for Globin, they you can't really find them usually elsewhere. You can find them in the Globin shop though for a special price normally. But yeah, that's the basket, and I know there is stuff inside, so we're gonna look at what's inside. Okay, so this was inside, um, and then I did find it in the book. So this is a fair trade scarf. Uh, made out of 100% cotton and it says measurements is one size fits all um, 62 inches by 22 inches with a one and a half inch fringe which you can see over here and then it says hand wash in cold water and hang to dry uh, this was made in Thailand okay so I'm gonna open it up I want to see this it sounds like it's really pretty big oh look at that I have to figure out what I want to do with it. Maybe I might keep it and actually use it in the winter time. You're probably thinking, Kit Kat, you live in Hawaii. Why would you need a scarf? So anybody that actually knows me, if it's below 80 degrees, I'm cold already. <laughs> Which in the winter time, it's usually in the 60s and 70s. So winter in Hawaii, I am literally wearing boots and sweaters and scarves and my coworkers think I'm crazy because I wear that in winter weather here in Hawaii. But hey, at least I get to wear winter clothes because I get cold so easily. So I either might keep this or gift it. I'm not sure yet what I'm going to do with it. But it's really, really nice and it feels really nice. And it looks really well made. Um, I really like it. So we're going to put that on side and we're going to go to the next item. So this one is um, hot chocolate, so cocoa, um, divine chocolate cocoa. And I want to just say that when Nicole opened this one in her box, I was like, that's the box for me because I love hot chocolate. Um, I don't drink coffee or tea really. I only drink tea when I'm sick and I don't drink coffee at all. It's a little too bitter for me. Um, and normally I just drink water all the time. Um, that's like the one healthy decision I make in my life is I drink water all the time but I love hot chocolate I feel like this box like I saw because I was like ooh stuff that I can use in the winter which would be hot chocolate and a scarf but um I can drink hot chocolate anytime just saying and one of my favorite ice cream places makes what they call a frozen hot chocolate so they use actually cocoa mix and use that to make the ice cream. It's a rolled ice cream experience. If you don't know what that is, look it up. Rolled ice cream is awesome. Um, but this is fair trade cocoa powder and um, it's a hundred percent cocoa powder. Uh, it says store in a cool and dry place and it was made in Ghana. So the company is called Divine Chocolate. So that's the name of the company. And then it says, seriously good chocolate, fair trade cocoa grown by family farmers in Ghana, no artificial flavors, natural ingredients, 100% pure cocoa butter, and no palm oil or soy, which I love because I do my best to not buy products that have palm oil in it due to the deforestation that's happening because of the palm oil industry. Um, I highly recommend you look it up and try not to buy products that have palm oil in it. But yeah. I'm super excited. I'm so ready to try this. Oh my god. I have whipped cream in my fridge, so I'm good to go. <laughs> okay, we're gonna put this on the side. And one more thing, which is very protected. Look at how well this thing is packaged. And you will see after I open it why they need to package it like this. 
So this is what was so well protected in the box. Look how pretty that is. Oh my goodness. So this is a Malika mug. It's um, six inches by four inches by five inches, made out of stoneware ceramics. Um, it is dishwasher and microwave safe, which is great to know. Um, and this was made in Morocco. Um, but this is so beautiful and I love it. And like the perfect thing to use. Look how much, I mean, you could probably put a lot in there. Oh my goodness. Um, I will definitely use this when I'm feeling like a lot of hot chocolate and stuff. Or just in general because it's a really, really nice product. And I really like it. Ooh, in the notes it says try steamed milk with honey. I love steamed milk. Like, I love steamed milk. There is a breakfast place, which is probably not doing sit down service right now due to the shutdown, but um, there is this breakfast place called AK Cafe that serves steamed milk. They don't have it on the menu anymore, but I know I can ask for it because I did that the last time. And what I do is I get the steamed milk and I get um, natural sugar and mix that in with the milk to sweeten it a little bit. Mm so good but anyways i love this um i love the box i love everything that i got um just gotta decide if i want to keep this forever i definitely want to keep this because i could it's a really good size and i could put so much stuff in there and like i collect so much little things this definitely will be useful for me um but yeah thank you for joining me um let me know what you thought about the cozy box um I loved it and definitely go check out Nicole's channel I highly recommend it because she's awesome and her goats are awesome and she gets a lot of different boxes so very very highly recommend that and yeah um, if you're thinking about trying Globin I definitely recommend it um, it's $40 a month uh, you do pay less if you do 3 months, 6 months, or 12 months um, prepaid. So it does become cheaper. $40 a month if you live within the um, 40 contiguous states of the United States, then shipping is free. Unfortunately, if you live in Hawaii like me or if you also live in Alaska, we are not attached to the main landmass it is $10 to ship, which adds a lot to the price, which is also why I kind of made the decision to not get any more but yeah I'm not sure about internationally you'd have to check their website I'm like having brain fries guys I don't know what's going on with me today but um yeah thanks for watching and um if you like the video please give me a like and subscribe if you'd like to see more um let me know what you thought of this box and if you do have recommendations for subscription boxes, let me know. Um, I'll definitely go ahead and check it out and possibly add it to my list. Um, let me know what you think of Globin also. I think they're an awesome company, just not for me right now. And yeah, thank you so much. Please take care wherever you are in the world. Have a wonderful morning, day, or evening. Stay safe and stay fabulous. Bye.